This is Minister Paul, a watchman on the wall in Northern California. I have some important information to come out, and I'll, I'll be quick with this. So it is September 3rd, 2017, a Sunday at 7.31 a.m., and that's Pacific Standard Time. God has been outpouring these visions unto people. You're looking at a clock ticking down to midnight. I want to explain something. I had another vision last night, and it was very real and very serious. So I had woken up and I look over at the clock and it's exactly 333 and I began to ask the Lord like what does this mean there has to be a deeper meaning than this the odds of this being a coincidence are just out there it just couldn't be and so I started thinking like is it nine or what are you trying to show me and I instantly went into this this flash vision I'm telling you this was so real I'm telling you with all my heart I'm asking people to listen this thing was real so I, all of a sudden, and I'm awake. I'm totally awake. I see a Navy ship. And it, there's an explosion like, and it's on fire. I couldn't find a picture to show exactly what I saw, but it wasn't a huge fire like you're seeing here. But it was, it was a fire. It was like an explosion. And so I'm showing some images of this that I saw. And uh, after I see, I'm going to be clear, a Navy ship, explosion, and a fire, and then I hear this. Haywood. It just rang through my head. I'm going to say like, Haywood. And I'm wide awake now. When before I was sleeping. And so I come in here and I, I put in USS Haywood. I didn't even know there was such a thing. But I know I've I seen that from God. I just know. And so it was a ship. And this ship was, it's actually, there's a class of it, the Haywood class attack transport. So there was a USS Haywood. I heard it. I saw an explosion. And I come in here and look it up. And what it is, is right before World War II started, this ship was bought from commercial people and converted into a marine carrier, an amphibious assault carrier that carried troops. And, and it won seven battle stars. And what, it, what, it, what happened was, New York, San Francisco. So what happened in summary here was this, this, uh, this was fitted as a troop transport after being bought commercially for the United States Navy in Portland, Oregon. And look, it was made by Bethlehem Shipbuilding right here in California. Bethlehem, named after Charles Haywood, but I, which I'm going to go look at right now. Because I know that there's something about this. There, it, 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 I have to share this right now, I do. Um, because it, what happened was this was converted into a troop carrier just before World War II started. And now I'm being shown an explosion and a fire on a Navy ship right before World War III is about to start, if it hasn't started already. So then I come in here to add on to this. I come out here and I see that there's been a nuclear test right here where I'm putting the, the mouse cursor, it's coming in, there was two explosions, it's coming as a 6.3 explosion out of North Korea. This is their sixth nuclear test. On the same time, God showed me this seven battle star uh, troop carrier having an explosion and a fire. The same, I mean, right before I come out here, to see this, a 6.3. I'm going to tell you what, this is being underreported. This thing was, it, this this North Korean missile test was thermonuclear. It was an H-bomb. Remember, I think it was about two weeks ago, God took, gave me the word gravity bomb. He stopped playing. He's warning us. He's literally shouting. He's warning us of this war to start. And so if you if you go to Twitter... North Korea has released official information, and I'm just going to read a part of it. It says, Norway seismologist, this thing, was, this thing hit so hard, even though it was so far underground, that it caused damage on the China border. 
And now there's video of him moving it onto an ICBM, and we're still not hearing any response from the government. He's, there's video of Kim Jong-un monitoring this thermonuclear weapon that was just tested onto an, IC, an intercontinental ballistic missile. And I feel like everybody's asleep. So it says, look, right here, six hours ago, North Korea H-bomb test had explosive yield of 120 kilotons. The, the bomb they dropped on Hiroshima in, uh, for World War II in comparison was 15 kilotons. This one was 120 kilotons. They're not playing this. Right here. 6.3 explosion says a 6.3 puts us up around a megaton that would be a staged thermonuclear weapon folks remember God said he's gonna bring a sword anyway I've just shared this as lead be it obedient praise God that that's literally all I could do I know people understand but man I'm getting a little uh what's the word for I'm, I'm getting a little on edge as if something is about to happen and I pray for peace because man who else I mean just replay it and you'll understand the depth of this